Seven skeletons mojang should add to Minecraft in the near future. Let's go check them out. Hey guys, what's going on? Spot players here. Welcome back to another video, guys. Today we're back in Minecraft for another fantastic video. And today, what we're going to do is we're going to look at seven different skeletons that I think Minecraft should add in the future to the game because that would be absolutely insane. So, what do we have today? We have ourselves the fire skeleton. Ooh, we have ourselves a creeper skeleton. And of course, we got ourselves some explosions. We got ourselves a minor skeleton. We got ourselves an ender skeleton, a obsidian skeleton, a pirate skeleton, and of course, the Skelebrine. Because who, who, who cannot get enough here, Brian? I know I can. So, Skelebrine is definitely something that is gonna be needed inside of the game. So, let's go check them out today. I'm wearing right now a full set of diamond. I as well have some more drops to show off later on. What you can do with them, and of course, what you can make them into, because with new skeletons comes new drops, 100%. So, let's get right into it. So we're gonna get started with the fire skeleton. A lot of these are not that strong, so I'll probably like few hit them. So as well, we're gonna go to time. Time set night and difficulty hard. Yes, we're gonna make it hard for us. So, Fire Skeleton coming in right now. Let's go over to uh, game mode zero. There we go, we're game mode zeroed up. So, here comes the Fire Skeleton. Ooh, he's, he's, he's going through the floor a little bit. Oh, okay, okay, so he does do fire damage. So, he doesn't seem to be the most deadly one, though. So, he doesn't shoot fireballs. I thought he would shoot fireballs because he's a Fire Skeleton, but... It makes, it makes sense, like, what does he even shoot a fireball with? Maybe his bow, but he doesn't have one, so... Um, but he does do fire aspect on hit, which is a pretty nasty, especially if there would be a few of them. And three hits with a diamond sword is enough, so, uh, let's do this one more time. Take him down. Easy peasy, lemon squeezy. But still really cool, I like it, it would be a nice addition for inside of the nether, so, uh... Definitely something I would love to see in there. And there's one of the drops. The Flame Bone. Alright, let's go to the next one, which is going to be the Creeper Skeleton. We gotta have his Creeper Skeleton, right? A Creeper Skeleton, always very nice. Let me numb on some Golden Apples right now. Drop in a Creeper Skeleton. I think this one looks amazing. Look at that. That looks so cool. Oh my days. Let's take a look at him again. He has a little teensy inside of his body. Oh, it's a real creeper. Real one besides the skeleton creeper. Oh no, he got demolished. No, the creeper is gone. R.I.P. creeper. You will be missed. So let's just drop in a few of them. Oh my days. As well, they drop. Oh no, my chest. No. <laughs> Alright, let me just pick up everything so I do not lose. All of these eggs. Oh no, I was prepared fully. And these creeper skeletons, of course, just ruined my day. But they can as well drop TNT if you uh, manage to destroy them before they destroy you. So that's absolutely insane. Oh my god, now I have to set up my chest again. There we go, we don't have an ender chest, so we cannot explode. So we just checked out the fire skeleton and the creeper skeleton. It's time for the minor skeleton, which we have over here. Let's grab ourselves a few eggs. Uh, this one should be able to find, be found in mines, of course, because it's a minor skeleton. This one looks really cool. It has himself a golden miner helmet and a iron pickaxe. Does he have... Oh, he spawns with different kind of pickaxes. Let's spawn in a few more. There we go. See, like, even in shadow pickaxes is what they spawn with, so... Let's take them down. They are not probably the most. Let's see. Let's see. Oh, they actually do quite a lot of damage. Well, what? Did you do, do a heart of damage on full diamond armor? Wow. Okay. They actually do a lot of damage. I didn't expect them to do that. Of course, they use a pickaxe. So, oh my god. These enchanted ones are even worse. So, they can drop their pickaxe, which is really cool. And zombies can pick them up, of course, as well. Give me back my pickaxes. So, does this have anything interesting? If I see two with iron pickaxes, that's not bad at all. So, you can literally farm yourself some iron pickaxes from these. Uh, but you can as well get yourself a miner's helmet. These are all the items we're going to take a look at after. So, the flame bone, the pirate sword, and the obsidian bone as well. We have ourselves some frozen bones. Uh, but these are from a other skeleton, which I didn't think that was that interesting. So, we're leaving it out of today's video. But it's really, so really cool. I love the minor skeleton. Definitely a really good one to add. So, next up on the list is going to be the Ender Skeleton. You guys could probably uh, guess what this is going to be. Like, sort of an Enderman, but it's in skeleton form. So, let's go uh, eat up a golden apple. And let's go take one down. I wonder what kind of attributes it's going to have. So, boom. There we go. Ooh. Okay. If we look at it, oh, it's gonna have the same thing. Oh, dear. Oh, dear. Okay, this one is a creepy fella. Like always. Oh, my days. Where are you at, dude? I think he escaped. I think he went somewhere, but I need to take one down. So I'm spawning in another one. 
quickly. Dude, stop running away. Oh, there he is. Urgh. Urgh. Oh, he's, he's actually really tanky. He packs quite a punch, I must say. Let's do it again. Let's do it again. Yeah, he's teleporting around. He doesn't like me at all. Oh, my God. Okay, so this one's even worse than Enderman. Even worse than Enderman. Oh my god, and they as well drop, of course, the Ender Pearl, which lets you teleport around. So next up on the list, we have ourselves the Obsidian Skeleton. This one's pretty cool. It's quite tanky. Already tried this one out before, uh, but this one looks really cool. It's pretty slow. Let me see how much damage it does. Yeah, like, like, okay, so it is like a heart to half a heart. That's actually pretty nice, but this thing is tanky because it's made of obsidian so this guy can take quite a few punches it looked like not too many but still it's really tanky for its kind probably has some armor on and of course it can drop the obsidian bones which we showed before as well we're gonna show at the end what you can make of these two because they are pretty cool but look at them look at them taking there we go and that's the obsidian bone as well Really awesome and some lovely XP to top it all off. Next upon the list is going to be the Pirate Skeleton. So this one could be a little bit like the Drowns right now 1.14. Which show they spawn maybe in the ocean. Or they spawn actually near shipwrecks. Which would make a lot of sense if we ever sell the Pirate. So here they are. They look awesome. And they can drop a Pirate Sword. Which they actually did. Let me as well turn it to Time Set Night. Because then they will not burn immediately into the sunlight. But it's really, really cool. And I love these things. I would love it if they had a little pirate head, but I guess they have their yellow tooth and as well their little eye patch, which is looking really cool. I love this skeleton. I think this is my favorite so far because of that they can actually spawn maybe near the, the sunken ships, which may make a lot of sense. Before we go to the last one, which is gonna be the Skelebrine, the Herobrine version of the skeleton we are checking out what you can actually do with all of these items so they're actually very simple they can just be crafted into one item and one item alone so what you guys can craft this into is you take your obsidian bones for example you put them into a 404 grid you get yourself some free obsidian so if we do this boom 16 pieces of pure obsidian which is really nice get yourself saves you some uh, some mining time by uh, taking down some skeletons I think this is uh, my favorite recipe of the ones we have, but there's still some other ones that are very, very useful. We have also a flame bone, which is going to turn everything into some coal, which is really nice. Pretty, pretty easy source of coal. We never need to get into anything else. You never need to go mine. Just take down some of the bones right there. And then as well, we have ourselves the frozen bone, which turns it into ice which is really cool so now we have some free ice some free obsidian and some free coal by just defeating some skeletons and of course the other two are gonna be the pirate sword and the miner's helmet so we can put this on as well looks pretty cool we're a miner right now uh, I don't really know what kind of stats this would give, but I think this is like maybe a little bit better than a golden helmet in, or just a golden helmet in protection, but a little bit more durability. Still looks really awesome. I think it would be a great addition to have some different hats in Minecraft as well. And then we have ourselves the pirate sword, which is a little bit less damaging than the diamond one, but still a free sword to get, which is looking really awesome. Loving the pirate sword. Look at this. This one looks sick. Oh, it's time for the final one, but it's going to be the Skelebrine. I think it's perfect to take him on with the pirate sword uh i have a splash potion i have a, a strength potion of strength 2 for 1.30 minutes uh and i think we're gonna see how thing how tough this thing's gonna be so let's spawn him in oh there we go he can't he doesn't take damage from sunlight which is awesome so let's see he makes the sound of a ghast Let's see how much damage. oh i thought he did my whole hp bar okay but he does a winner so that thing is pretty Pretty tanky. Okay, there we go, there we go, there we go. Take him down. I think he has a lot of HP. There we go. Oh, my God. Ooh, that thing gives me the uh, gives me the creeps. But he does a lot of damage. Like, he hit me one time and had four hearts of damage with that Wither. So, that is something you shouldn't mess with. Especially if there's quite a few of them. So, and of course, I wouldn't be me without trying it out. So, let's just uh, dump in a few of them. Boom, 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 boom. There we go. And let's take my diamond sword. And let's go take him on. Oh, dear. The sound is atrocious. The sound is atrocious. Ah, so much screaming. The gas are screaming. Oh, my God. Skelebrine. And he drops nether stars. Oh, my lordy. Look at that. 
Got ourselves a free nether stars. This was some leather caps. I don't know why. Oh, I am almost literally at two hearts. Look at that. Oh my god. Okay, okay. This is this thing is pretty crazy. You probably shouldn't take this on too much. But still, he drops nether stars, which is insane. Let's just do a few more. Few more. Come on. Show your strength. Strength two going in. Go ahead. There we go. There we go. Boom, 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 boom. Farm it up. Farm it up. Oh, they do a lot of damage. My HP is going down. No, please. 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 Oh, my God. Oh, my God. There we go. There we go. Two more. Two more. Two more. Two more. Yeah. There we go. Look at that amount of Nether Stars. That's pretty cool. Of course, I don't know if this should drop Nether Stars, but I think it will be really cool if they will be able to get them. Like, I don't know. They probably have, like, some secret way to spawn, but... Those are all the skeletons. The seven skeletons I think Mojang should add to Minecraft in the future. So if you guys think this video was absolutely insane, be sure to drop a like down below. It would help me out a lot. Of course, share this video with your friends. Subscribe if you are new for more videos. And I'll say take care. Love you. Bye. Thanks so much for watching. And of course, take care. And be sure to eat your golden apple.